G'day everybody, my name's Luke Fitzpatrick and thank you for supporting Fish That Snag. Well this is a question that pops up quite regularly on different forums, particularly on social media pages. It's the topic of polarised eyewear. Is it worth it or is it not worth it to grab yourself a decent pair of polarised eyewear for out on the water while you're fishing? I think it is and here's why. First of all, I'm lucky enough to be supported by Spotters Eyewear who have an awesome range of polarised eyewear. What makes theirs different from others? Well, theirs is called a photochromic ground glass. What that basically means is they're glass. They're not actually like that plastic material that you might find in other sunglasses. So they're pretty indestructible. Um, and trust me, I drop them all the time apart from out the boat. I'm always bashing them around in the boat and I've not managed to scratch them or break them yet. And there's two types that I use. First type is the penetrator lens. Uh, the type of frame that I, I wear is called a combat frame in a medium size. Uh, the combat frame just sits nicely on my ugly noggin um, and I use the penetrator lens first up in the morning. The penetrator lens um, is really good because it, it, it works really well in low light conditions. Okay, So first up in the morning just as the sun's starting to peek its head up, uh, these are absolutely fantastic. They give me awesome depth perception and it actually increases the color contrast uh, when I'm trying to look through the water. And I'll show you what I mean by that uh, very shortly with some footage. Later in the day, once the sun starts coming up a bit and you get that real sort of glare on top of the water, um, that's when you start suffering a bit of eye fatigue and things like that, especially if you've got sensitive eyes like I do. And I switch to combat frame again but this time the nexus lens okay it's a blue mirror blue green mirror lens and it offers exactly the same as the penetrator lens in terms of depth perception um, helps in low light conditions and things but it also really helps with eye fatigue okay the mirror takes a lot more of that bang that you cop from the reflection off the sun on the water these are the ones I probably wear most of the time, plus they look really cool in videos and stuff as well. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is I'll just show you some quick footage of the Nexus lens. Okay, It's done a little crudely because I can't take the lens out and stick it on the camera to show you what I mean. So what I've done is I've basically put the lens across the top of the camera like that Okay, while I'm out on the water. Now there's a little bit of light that manages to come in on the sides and things but you'll really be able to see what I mean out on the water when you're looking in in the shallows uh, to spot fish structure and things like that. So let's take a look. <laughs> So there you go, polarized eyewear. I definitely think it's worth it. Spend the cash, go out there and get yourself a decent pair. Highly recommend Spotter's polarized eyewear. They do great deals for everybody and if you need to know where you can find them, just leave a comment and I can point you in the right direction.